time to shake it up. I'm headed into one of the top cocktail festivals in the U.S. to experience some cocktails, some food, and yes, yeah, some culture. The busiest woman in the whole building. It is the busiest woman the, in the house. The whole building. There's a variety of different things in yeah. here. I mean, there's not just one thing. That's I mean, right. how do you come up with such a variety? A lot of these brands that you see here, they're using San Diego as a launching pad. They want to exhibit and showcase their products. That's why you see such a variety. You got some stars. I, I mean, got some stars. how do you get the stars? I mean, a lot of these stars have actually realized that they need to attach their names to some sort of a alcohol. So if you saw Vince Neil, he has a vodka, he has a tequila. Ron Jeremy, who was here, he has a rum named after him. So what better way for them to promote their products so that the public can see them, so that they're real, right. they're the real people. I'm here with Vince Neil, hanging out. New liquor, the name is, I've been challenged trying to say it right, first thing, but the name is pretty cool. Hey, well, tell me how you came up with that name. Well, I mean, tattoo. He's tattooed in right. Spanish. Tatuado. Uh-huh. I mean, come on. Now look at the ink. The ink, <laughs> the ink tells it all, the right? The ink tells it all, yeah. I mean, tatuado is tatuado. You have a couple different things. You got tequila and vodka. Like, I mean, that's a challenge in both. Well, I, I mean, I, I've had tequila for a long time, so that was an easy one. <laughs> right. But I figured, hey, might as well do vodka. Now I got rum coming out, too. Ooh. Got an energy drink coming out. You don't play. You gotta go big, man. <laughs> go big or go home, right? Go big or go home. Go big or go home. <laughs> You look good. I mean, have you tasted it? Over and over again, at least 10 times a day. <laughs> See, that's the fun thing about being at a, a spirits festival. You get to taste things over and over and over. Are we going to 11 here? Shit, man, we'll go until this place shuts down, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you got jokes. I, I didn't know yeah, it was a funny Ladies, thing. the more you drink, the better I look. I try to promote a family healthy uh, rum. A family healthy rum, yeah, right. You got the whole line. We got two. We got the dark rum and the spice rum. The joke is that um, Captain Morgan's on one leg, I'm on three. <laughs> Be totally honest. Be honest don't don't bullshit. It. What do you think? Smell it. Oh, that's some that's some strong stuff. Yeah, don't put it on my nose, but it's strong. Oh, no. Oh, that's some good stuff. It's I a mean, vanilla E, very, uh, you know. So, I mean, what? 96 it? proof. You look, you, what's the look there? I mean, you got like your face is kind of like. It looks like Che Guevara. This is a 20-year-old <laughs> photo. I look better in the old days. But it, got, it kind of got like a swagger to you, you know what I mean? It shows, that's the rough ages, I don't. And once you get filled up on spirits, you can head outside where they're cooking up some awesome food. Shamrock, shamrock, and shrimp. You didn't show me, that, that was like a sneaker room. It was a secret. It was a secret. <laughs> Snuck in at the last minute. <laughs> we got inspired, we had some shrimp. That's some good stuff. So I'm, I'm gonna have to taste that. And look at that. What's better? You just pull out some liquor. I'm gonna liquor. have to taste this. Liquor just came out of nowhere. Are you gonna add that to the shrimp? Uh, no, just add it to the belly. Add it to my bread. Right. Let's see where it goes from there. <laughs> What's this? What's you putting on there? This is a honey coconut hibiscus shrimp with a little bit of uh, sambul alik chili. Everybody tries to cook shrimp. We burn them. You 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 mess them up. What are you doing? Less is more. All secret, right? Okay. It's uh, whether it's calamari, whether it's shrimp. It's just gotta be barely pink. And there's a little bit of a gray translucency to it. As soon as that gets out, it's done. It's not. No, it's not. We want it to be tender, not chewy. And the only way to capture that is by doing it fast. You're gonna, you're gonna taste one of them. What taste is? It's, it's, it's a little hot. It's, it's got a little spice to it. It's, it's a little, little hot. But what you're gonna notice is that there's give in the bite, right? It's gonna snap in your mouth a little bit because it's cooked right. Very different taste. Unique. Yeah, that's never good. That, that, my boy's laughing back there. He's like, it's he's good. Out. <laughs> it's good. It's good stuff. With plenty of fish, fresh ingredients, and live cooking demos, you can learn how to cook like the pros if you haven't had too much to drink. Ready? Ready? Like college, right? Right, college. Take it back. That's how you drink at the Spirits Festival. Oh my God, are you filming this? I'm a teacher. You can't show this. <laughs> With great entertainment, fun people, good food, and plenty to drink, you may just get lucky at the San Diego Spirits Festival. That is not how you train usually. Whatever, I was being 
and dainty. <laughs> she tried to play it. I was being feminine. <laughs> Thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to us. Click the top video to see our previous episode. Click the bottom video to see our first season. And remember to see INETV.